Imagine strolling through the streets of Paris or gazing at the picturesque landscapes of the French countryside, all in vivid color. Thanks to the innovative photochrome process, black and white photos were transformed into stunning works of art. The photochrome process was the brainchild of Hans Jakob Schmid, an employee of the Swiss company Aurel Gessner Fusli. This printing firm, with a history dating back to the 16th century, revolutionized the world of photography. In the mid-1890s, the process was licensed by other companies, including the Detroit Photographic Company in the U.S. and the Photochrome Company of London. It quickly gained popularity, becoming the basis for the famous Faustint process. During this time, true color photography was still in its early stages and not commercially viable. However, the photochrome process filled the gap, allowing people to experience the beauty of France in vibrant hues. In 1898, the U.S. Congress passed the Private Mailing Card Act, which allowed private publishers to produce postcards. These postcards could be mailed for just one cent each, making them accessible to people from all walks of life. Publishers around the world seized this opportunity and created thousands of photochrome prints showcasing cities and landscapes. These prints were then sold as postcards, making the beauty of France accessible to people far and wide. The photochrome process itself was a meticulous and time-consuming endeavor. It involved coating a tablet of lithographic limestone with a light-sensitive emulsion and exposing it to sunlight under a photo negative for several hours. The emulsion would then harden, creating a fixed lithographic image on the tablet. Multiple litho stones were prepared for each tint used in the final color postcard, resulting in a stunningly realistic image. The attention to detail and the lifelike colors achieved through the photochrome process were truly remarkable for its time. These postcards transported people to the streets of Paris, the charming villages of Provence, and the breathtaking landscapes of the French Riviera. Today, these photochrome postcards serve as a visual time capsule, preserving the beauty and essence of France in the late 19th century. They offer a unique perspective on a bygone era and allow us to appreciate the artistry and innovation of early color photography.